rebel, to resist or defy an authority or a generally accepted convention. I am awesome! <laughs> Woo! Rock and roll! Famed for her outspoken, devil-may-care attitude, Pink established herself as the anti-pop star and was a breath of fresh air in the bubblegum pop world of the 1990s, obsessed with Britney Spears. With her defiant attitude and honest lyrics, this rogue musician quickly showed signs of becoming one of the rare artists to transcend and outgrow the pop label. Her rebellious nature was evident from childhood. Disorderly conduct, shoplift, I mean I did steal showgirls, I'll admit to that one, but, and then I took it back because it sucked. But, um, just dumb stuff, you know? I lived in a small town and honestly the police had nothing better to do than harass kids that they didn't think fit their picture of a wholesome young girl or boy. Unwilling to be pigeonholed, Pink found fame with her funky, break the mold mix of R&B influenced pop delivered with punk attitude and her hit song Get This Party Started became a number one dance floor anthem. The singer's first album, Can't Take Me Home, featured the top 10 hit, There You Go. Tired of being marketed as another cookie-cutter pop act and eager to become a more serious songwriter and musician, Pink took her sound in a new direction and sought more creative control during the recording of her second album, Misunderstood. I'm so, so sick. Her live performances prove that she's more than just a passing phase in today's world of musical talents. Her brash confidence has appealed to many fans and has encouraged many young girls that you don't have to change who you are to be successful. In her role as the defiant rock rebel, Pink has proved she can even handle anything the press throws at her. Sorry for asking this. Uh, are you a lesbian? <laughs> Just for the record, no, she isn't. <laughs> wow! Pink married her longtime love, motocross biker Kerry Hart, in 2005. Pink contributed the hit song Feel Good Time for the Charlie's Angels sequel, Full Throttle. Good morning, Angels. Good, Good morning, morning, Charlie. Charlie. Today's mission, acquire the encoded titanium rings. Agent Pink is already following a lead at the motocross bowl. Join her there and help her find the ring. Pink had a cameo appearance in the film as a motocross race promoter. And in true Rebel style, it was at a real motocross race where she held up a sign that read, Will you marry me? as Carey rode past. A new album in 06 came with a different sound but the same attitude as she delivered a slap in the face to everyone's favourite tabloid starlets. I was in a very ridiculous mood that day. It's just a song about girls. It's a little judgmental and wrong, but I can't help it sometimes. Stupid girls ruffled a few feathers as she takes pot shots at a certain hotel heiress's sex tape and a newlywed star's music video. Pink admits that she wrote the song in a tongue-in-cheek manner. It's really funny. It's all in good fun. But it's very poking fun at the epidemic <clears throat> that's going on in the world right now that everyone has bought into. In the song, Pink sings about women who are more concerned about their hair than being educated and feels it was her responsibility to try and change that perception. And no offense to, you know, well, okay, offense, whatever, I don't really care. I'm making fun of it because that's what I do. No one else talks, so why shouldn't I? <laughs> this rebel is proof that you don't have to conform to society's pop princess image to be successful. I totally won. <laughs> that's awesome.